I'll admit, I'm surprised I don't get more flack for doing stuff like this, to be honest, because I've started so many runs lately and, you know, just leave them hanging for a while. Or in some cases, you know, months or half a year or more. I really need to get to some projects again, but, you know, you gotta be in the right mood sometimes. So I figured I'd start work on Aragon, you know, the movie based on a book by a teenager. And yes, there are missions with the dragon, but this game is actually relatively uh, short, to be honest. There's, there's only 16 missions total, and one of them is a tutorial stage. So obviously, you know, there's not much fighting to be had there. Though there is a secret egg we have to collect if we want to unlock bonuses. And yeah, we're going to do a new game, and we'll just put on normal difficulty. After all, I don't feel like a challenge today. I mean, if I want that, I'll go play a challenge run Pokemon like Mono Rock or something where I know I'm going to have a hard time because so many rock types are super slow. And yeah, I got to compensate for the weaknesses by over-leveling. A time without tyranny or fear. When dragon riders feel disguise. But that time has long passed. And the ruthless Galvatorix now rules the land. And Doza. A wicked shit enforces Galvatorix's iron rule. But the reach of despots is limited. And even Galvatorix couldn't touch one unsuspecting farm boy. A boy whose heart burned with hope and courage. And who's hungry for deer. I mean, come on. That's ah, some prime deer there. We better go get to it. And roll. And roll some more. I don't know if it makes you faster, but, you know, it supposedly helps, according to, you know, the movie stars. So, do some rolling. I know it makes you faster in, um, Ocarina of Time if you roll. Oddly enough. You wouldn't think that'd be the way it works, but, yeah. Rolling makes you quicker. It's weird. And, yeah, you have to use specific combos here or it won't break them. Very weird, if you ask me. I mean, why do I want to do specific combos? Unless it's to grab people and be a dick and be like, punch them in the chest. Oh no! They're gonna let my deer get away and make me hungry! I really need that deer meat. I'm a growing boy. Who wants to go on adventure? Well, you know, not die like those losers. Uh Damn useless minions. Why did they even bother? Useless. But the crystal. I don't know why you sent them in first if you could light the whole place on fire. Damn it. It sensed me. Must be a Highlander. Chase is on. Damn deer. That's too far away now. I can't shoot it. Okay. If I jump, I could just reach that ledge. Yeah, I need to jump and climb up here. Most definitely. Okay. Well, can't, can't do anything jump. there. I have to grab that ledge to get across. Got it. Just make my way Can I, like, there. climb up it? Like, I see a secret up there. Can I, like, jump on here? Okay, how do I get up there? There we go. This is mine! Sweet. That is my secret egg. At least it's easier to get than the eggs in Spyro. I mean, come on, those are always a pain in the butt. Oh, darn it, the deer got away. Oh, it was still there. Well, whatever. Yeah, we can toggle with uh, the R button. Otherwise, it just picks targets for us. But some targets are so far away, you gotta do some precision shooting by drawing f all the way back. Which can take a bit longer. As you, like, zero in the target, you know, like some sort of sniper. Darn it. Let go a little too early. You gotta wait for the controller to start shaking for this to work. I was saying, I'm pretty sure I took out all the targets. Hmm. The 
What was the point of that? Didn't even let her say never or anything? Damn it! This egg's gonna be my dinner! It's getting scrambled or poached, I'm not sure which. But first I gotta poke it with my arrow. Like an idiot. Yes, like all young heroes, destined to change the world. In ways no one expects. It's quite annoying, to be honest. But yeah, I didn't like the first take, so decided to do it again, because we're going to see I have a save file already, and we're just going to save over it. Yep. Just, just save on that profile. Yes, I want to save over it. Just, just save it. Right over it. Come on. Faster, game. Faster! This ain't Fallen Stars. Pick up your pacing! And no, we don't have to make a reference to Pikachu offering up a pillow with padding. What? Whenever I hear pacing, that's the first thing that comes to my mind is that bad attempt at a Japanese pun. Or I should say adapting a Japanese pun to English. It was a terrible idea. But yes, use your combo just to gain an edge in battle. I think we're going to end up using grapple mostly, because we can do fun shenanigans with that, at least in the early stages. This spine was not a simple stone, but an egg. An egg containing a small blue dragon. The dragon quickly grew, as did the bond between them. And Eragon learned that the two could communicate without speaking. Galvatorix, meanwhile, was furious that the egg was lost, and he commanded Doza to find it. He feared a new rider would strengthen the resistance, led by a group called the Varden. Okay. Well, that'll do for this episode. Next time, you know, we'll uh, continue on and move on to this area, where I assume lots of people are going to die. But yeah, each of the circles represents a, a section of the game we have to play through. Until next time, then. See ya.